Ashley with two E's. The best that ever done it. Yeah. On the all new 93.7 The Beat. All right. See, so Audi 93.7 The Beat is H Town's Red Hip Hop and home of the Breakfast Club. My name is Ashley. I got a new friend in here. Yeah. You want to introduce yourself? It's the big step of the well known Flex, the Tusi. <laughs> Why, why are you a big stepper? You dance? What I'm, you talking about? I'm a big stepper, a well-known flexor, girlfriend, ass caresser. Did I? I heard you said you got two eyes because you need two eyes to see the vision. For sure. And then the two times is just because a way you, of living. Two times I work two times as hard as the next man. So I ain't got nothing to do with like stunners four times. It ain't, nah, nah, ain't related. Bro. I ain't even. I ain't even know about stunner. Y'all, yeah. y'all, and all these goddamn numbers. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> What's you doing in Houston? Um. We we work and you dig mm-hmm. doing everything that everybody ain't doing. So all these fucking like lines, radio lines. <laughs> bar. For sure. That's me though. Yeah, my, my whole lifestyle of movie. Mm-hmm. You dig? That's just me. But now nah, we we out here doing radio runs and stuff. Everything that everybody ain't doing. I, I mean, know stuff that that, that that artists afraid to do. Radio. You know so I I mean if it's like Charlemagne I get it but like you know we hit the low stations, the stations <laughs> the big stations we don't care yeah. what it is we, we hit everybody. everybody. So, but you were at TSU. What did you do out there? A radio interview. Okay. And then I left. You didn't cause no pandemonium on campus because these little fast yeah. ass girls was on Twitter. Nah, yeah, that was like, going crazy. Like, if you want to huh? spend the night, I got a bed for yeah, you. Yeah, they be going crazy, <laughs> huh? I be chilling, though. They be going crazy on them. You ain't hit up none of them? No. Do you plan you plan on coming back, though? Do you like a college tour or something? Yeah, for sure. I definitely want to. I got to go to Prairie View. I need to go to there. Uh, it's a couple places I got to go. Sure. Man, BC will tell you you can you can pop in Texas alone, so, <laughs> like, so. and a college tour and all that shit. Oh, so, most definitely. So I was listening to your your project Platinum Heart, which is out now. Yeah. And I saw you did you did do some interviews with like my peers. Uh-huh. You said you're from Syracuse. Yeah, Syracuse, New York. But then how did you get to Raleigh? So I moved to Raleigh when I was like uh, 13. Okay. Big, like just on some better life type shit. You dig? Um, that was like with your family. Yeah. Okay. So and then. Ever since then, yeah, I just been rocking, rocking in, in the Carolinas. Come on, now. what's going on? What's in the water out there? What y'all doing? Everybody been asking that. Y'all think there's <laughs> something in the water? I mean, when everyone pops at one time so, and it's like a big movement, something crazy going on. Huh? Yeah. Nah, I, I feel like baby just really like that's how you kick the door off the hinges. You dig? That's really how you do it. He he kicked. You know how niggas talk about uh, people kick doors off hinges? Mm-hmm. Like they kick the door down. That nigga really like kicked the door down and, and then brought, kept it open and brought so, brought people so, with him. Yeah. yeah. So ain't no ain't no ain't no closing that shit now. <laughs> it's over. How you feeling about all these markets you're visiting? Seeing. I feel good. You dig it? It's it's it's, it's good for me. You know what I mean, a lot of personalities, not a lot of a lot of new people. Mm-hmm. Is there snow in North in Raleigh? Nah. It, so, sometimes it do, do snow, but like rarely, like rare, like probably like once or twice. Gotcha. You have you been in that yet? And yeah. like blizzards. I'm from no, oh, yeah. I'm from Syracuse, New York. I know you said like you moved, so like yeah, nah, though, yeah. nah. I ain't moved. I, you know, <laughs> when I moved, I moved when I was like 13. But when I moved, I was back and forth still. Oh, okay, and gotcha. So like you know, when I was th- 12, 13, I was still experiencing life though. Like, you dig? <laughs> like I, done, I, I still remember stuff from 12, 13. Yeah. So yeah, I, 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 yeah, I done experienced all that. We done played football in the snow, all that. Ain't that. So what have you experienced as wild that you ain't never been through before? And all this traveling and promo. Really nothing. I grew up fast. <laughs> real for real. Like, it ain't nothing that I, I don't know. Like, I done seen it all. Okay. You ask me. I don't know. I got a bunch of crazy stories. Don't nothing surprise you? Nah. I don't get surprised. I mean, I, I saw your interviews. So. You, you see, like, a wild, a wild child. Yeah, I, I live life. But a, a good guy. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> I'm chilling, but nah, like, don't nothing surprise me. Don't nothing excite me. No, none of that. Got you. So, uh, so your most recent video you dropped was "Truth Be Told," uh-huh. but I was listening to your to your album today when I was driving here, and I really liked the song "Down to Ride." Yeah. And then I looked at Twitter; it's like everybody else liked that song too. For sure, for sure, for sure. But it's because of the line that you fell in love too fast, just from what your head did. Yeah, I fell in love. Is that know. a true story? For sure. <laughs> Dick, she done suck me up. And does, I fell in love. does that young lady in your is she in your life anymore? No, nah, I was playing. I ain't really like falling in love. It was, hey. just, it was just a lie. Like just like saying like. I, you know, um, not even just from head. You just infatuated, like, sexual, okay, yeah, I fuck se- with you, yeah. Se- yeah, sexual touch, though. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I fell in love from sexual touch. I, I could be that type of person, mm-hmm. but it's rare. So have you even ever, would you admit that if, have you ever been in love? Um, Because you got a, 
a lot of heartbreak in, in a lot of your songs. Yeah. You know? Well, have I ever been in love? I don't know. Really? I, I don't know. I, I can't tell you because I ain't in love right now. Mm. You dig? So until you, like, you dig, you in love, you would never really know if you've been in love because it's like, all right, so I had this type feeling for you, but maybe, like, I just met this new person and it's a whole new feeling. This might be what love feel like. You dig? So I don't know. I say I strongly felt for somebody before, though. But did it hurt when you separated from them? Yeah. Would you call that love or, like, just, like, no, infatuation or attachment? Attachment. Okay. Like, I wouldn't call that love because it's like, you know, people people hurt about different stuff. True. I mean, people hurt differently. So it's like, hey, what might have hurt me might not hurt you. I think 21 Savage said that. He was like, uh, he, don't, he doesn't want love. He wants loyalty because love is just so, being around someone all the time. You're attached to them. Yeah, for sure. But it's, it takes it's more for you to be loyal. Love. Like, everybody mm-hmm. got their own persona of love. Yeah. Like, love that. Love, cool. <laughs> it's cool. So, love, it ain't gonna pay no bills. <laughs> I mean, love, don't pay the bills. Yeah, it ain't gonna buy no chains. So, uh, speaking of that you're in here, our brother Black Zach drops tomorrow. Oh, uh, Carolina uh, Narco. Uh, I know on your album you didn't have no features. The, that, you, the way he say, he say he the big step of the well known flex and might fuck your bitch in a Tesla. <laughs> that's my dog. He says that. Yeah, that's what he say. So y'all y'all stealing each other's lines? Nah, no. Sharing. We put our own little sauce on it. For sure. So he dropped his track list. You didn't have any features on your album, but mm. are you doing features? Nah. Why? Nah. You just not, you nah. just trying to do you? Yeah, I be, I be, I be chilling. Well, am I doing features? Yeah, yeah, my fault. I am. But okay. Like, um, intentionally, nah. Like, it's always like good relationship type thing. If you vibe with them? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I don't want to work with no artists that I like, don't get a vibe from. Have you have you ever heard a song that where the the feature felt forced and you're like, eh. yeah, all the time, <laughs> all the time, all the time, and it's like, yo, like, ew. This wasn't like you obviously just did this for a check. Word. Like it wasn't going yeah, going nah, nowhere. Yeah, that ain't it. That ain't it. What's up? I love that sh- you know the whole SCMG click up in here, but yeah, I s- gang, gang. I saw you explain on a um, bootleg Kevin head just like. The process of Arnold like scouting you out yeah. and like signing with him, uh-huh. but like, what is it that's different over there? Cause you, I've interviewed every goddamn yeah. artist. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. What? From SCMG. yeah. Nah, you gotta get Big Mally. I do. She's the only one that hasn't for been sure. here yet. You yeah, get Big Mally. She's, she's the only star. one left. Yeah. For sure, nah. But what, uh, you say like, what's different? Like, yeah. What you, like, what you mean? Like, like, what's you know why I choose to go with them over another label? Um, cause it was home, and on top of it being home, like they made me feel good. Okay. Not only did they like, not even about making me feel good. Like they, 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 they treated me as if like they, they, they cared about me. You did. Got you. So, as long as you care about me and you got my best interest, that's what it's about. They got my best interest. My manager got my best interest. <coughs> Top of the records got my best interest. You gotta live in the Carolinas to sign. So, most definitely. Or no. <laughs> nah, yeah, you do. You gotta live in the Carolinas to sign with us. Cause that's the whole movement right now. Yeah, for sure. I did. I looked on your Instagram. Um, and I thought it was—I thought it was dope. I, you you shared a video where you kind of went live with your mom yeah. when you were like telling her like yeah, that's my dog. We yeah, have, like yeah, we have personal conversations, like real conversations. But why but, was it important for you to share that, like I guess it's, publicly? It's, it's people out here who who don't have conversations like that with their mother, or they won't, or they can't. You dig what I'm saying? So I gotta share that to the world and let the world know. Like, and plus, like people love my mom. You dig like they love Mama Toot. That's what they call it. Yeah, call it Mama Toot. Um, they love my mom, so I be wanting to let them know. Like, look, like me and my mom ain't perfect. Like, we have conversations, like deep conversations, because at the end of the day, this we human, and this was only gonna make our relationship better. You dig? So like, she was just getting on me. Oh yeah. And like I was just <laughs> like, cause cause like I wanted to let people know, like, look, y'all mommy, the only mom who get out. Like, she, you see my mom. But, like, one thing about my mom, she let me voice my opinion. And, like, I don't voice my opinion in a disrespectful way. Like, I, I always That's know. That's what I say, yeah. So I always know how to stay stay in line. But, like, we just talk. You know, that's my dog. We all we got. So, like, we have conversations. And I told her straight up, like, yo, like, if I don't give you enough time, because she said I don't give her enough time. Mm. So that's why I be trying to tell females, like, you dig? Like, if I mess with a female, like, nine times out of ten, like, she'll say that I don't give her enough time. I be like, yo, like, I don't even be give my, my mom, mom enough time, yeah. For sure, like, I be focused because at the end of the day, like, I think about the future. 
you heard I ain't thinking about right now. Right now you thinking about your feelings because you attached, but you you not thinking about the future. Like the future got so much more. It's gonna be time for us to for us to have time for each other in the future. Yeah. But right now it's grind mode. So I told my I had to tell my mom like sometimes you just gotta tell people you love them. Mm. I told her I'm like I love you. Yeah, and if I don't give you enough time, I'm sorry. Yeah, that, I'll, I'll fix it. For sure. Yeah, it was just it's something to break up all the regular shit I see on my timeline because yeah, you see just sure. like yeah. ass pictures, yeah. fashion over, yeah. <laughs> like, fashion, right. fashion over yeah. outfits and shit like that. Yeah, I be having to <laughs> let them know like, look, listen, here, all right, fake, fake, fake. Here goes some real. Yeah, sure. I appreciate that because a lot of people don't they want to keep their their family or their personal life Man. you know separate. And, and see, like, and, and you just gotta know how to do that. You did like like posting. Your mom crib, posting your mom like, I really don't. Do, I, I I avoid that. You mm. know what I'm saying because at the end of the day, like like Cardi B said, her mom like you know she like my dad don't walk around with security, like my mom don't walk around with security, and I'm not gonna put him in danger. Type so of shit, like, yeah. Mm. I won't lie, like it's a whole nation that's gonna die behind that. Like mm-hmm. my mom, we come deep behind that. Mm-hmm. Like, it's a whole nation that's gonna come behind that. So like if something ever happened to my mom. I want to let y'all know, like, people dying, no cap. Right. That's just he got a ski mask on, and we that's just we just having a conversation right now. Yeah. That's bottom line. But I'm a good person, though. I love everybody, but we don't play. But Mom Dukes, we don't play about. Man, I don't, I don't anybody I rock with, like, mm-hmm. if I, yo, anybody I rock with, if you around me and something go left, like, I'm, I'm, I'm going to shake it. It's out of here. Yeah, I'm going <laughs> to And I'm the first, I'll be first to attack. I'm the most quiet though. Mm-hmm. I'm first to go off though. You have siblings? For sure. I'm the you, youngest. Me too. You the how many? How many? Five. I oh, I only got I'm two others. Side, but I got uh, three brothers, two sisters. Okay. For sure. And I got three nieces and a nephew. It's like a it's like a complex though, because like I talked to the baby too. He's a baby, and I'm uh, like, we have this like complex to take care of everybody because yeah. we like yeah, the last of the, the line. Yeah. When yeah. You the youngest. You will <laughs> shake some up. Like when you the youngest, you don't, you don't play. Like it's like you don't. Oh, you you the most overprotective. We the most wild too. We the so, first like to step up, yeah, <laughs> to talk shit. Yeah. Yo, what? Yo, listen, <laughs> man. I remember one time it was a big old fight outside, like yo, with my family and like yo, it was like it was at this place called Thornton Park. We used to have rivalry games. It was a big fight with like my family, like just the other team. Yo, listen, when I say like, uh, I'm out of equipment, out pads, I'm coming out my helmet, shoulder pads. Hmm, like we shaking, like we really fighting, like yeah, I be yo, I go crazy. But my family, I don't play, man. Yeah, it, it's just that's gonna hit a different nerve. I'm the same. Is your mom like? Is she confrontational? or Is she kind of quiet? My she mom just, quiet. Okay, she, so she, then she, that makes she, you want to do it more because she so, don't. Yeah. Yeah, but she shake the room though. <laughs> yeah. Shake the room, tell you, she like you, you push her to that point though. Yeah. Yeah, my mom crazy now. Like she, she say I'm crazy. My family, my family try to tell me I'm crazy, but. They crazy. Where you think I got it from? Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, now nah, my sister though. My sister. Yo, my oldest sister. Oh nah. She it. Like she the crazy. She gotta be the wildest. Oh, I'm man. right behind her though. Like she called me. Whenever she called me, it's smoke. Like, Is she the oldest oldest? Like out of all nah, all she, y'all? She she, oh. she the second. Second oldest. Yeah. When she called me. I don't care where I'm at, I'm pulling up. I don't care if I gotta catch a flight back home. I cancel everything tomorrow. I'm there. I love you. We like to fight. So, we the same way. No, <laughs> it's love, so great. Yeah, yeah, that's bad though. I don't want them there. I I like to fight though. I do. It's a, I feel like fighting solve everything. I do too. And they so, be like, nah, like, like you tell, professional. Like You're not supposed to. Yeah. I love my homeboys, but I tell them like, yo, bro, we brothers. We could fight. Like, we'll man. go out, we'll go in the back for like Word. 10 minutes and then figure yo, it out. Yo, me and my homeboy, yo, bro, me, <laughs> me and my homeboy, Tyler, Amir, yeah. yo, we used to fight, like, I'm talking about, like fight, fight all yeah. the time. Like, yo, we get it shaking. <laughs> now we got older, though. Now we older. Like, we, so me and my homeboys won't fight. You ain't, yeah, yeah y'all calm down. Yeah, we, we, each other. we got too much to lose right yeah, now. Word. Exactly. We, yeah, we be focused. Um, I saw you last night with uh, Freddie in Dallas. Uh-huh. Y'all was yeah. y'all was running around. What's your itinerary like? Are you going to Austin for South by Southwest? Um, Is this virus keeping us like away? <laughs> yeah, I was about to say it don't look like nobody going to South by Southwest. Yeah, yeah, they about to shut it down. I said the same thing. I was like, I was gonna go, and then all yeah, those people dropped out lie. yesterday. I ain't yeah, to you what? I 
ain't trying to catch corona. I That's the same. <laughs> yeah. I even, I even know what the symptoms is. Mm-hmm. You dig what I'm saying? Like, I don't, I can't tell you what, like, happened. Like, maybe your foot turned a different color. I don't know what happened. So, like, I don't know if it ain't no symptoms. You just die. <laughs> like, so I'm good. Yeah. I'm staying away from that shit. You chilling. Yeah. So, how did you kind of build your buzz? Like, did you yeah. go to South by in the, in the past? Or, nah. like, how did you work your name around? Oh. Um, Really just like putting videos out on Instagram. Okay. Yeah, I used to I I, up, I used to upload snippets. I used to rap in the car. Like I, I used to do everything. You know what I'm saying? Doing everything that. Were you on Vine or no? No, I wasn't. <laughs> I wasn't. I wasn't. I wasn't on Vine. I used to watch Vines though. Yeah. I used to watch people Vines. I watched Vine blow up. Same. <clears throat> I used to do like I used to do everything though. I was just working. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean, um, getting my name out there. I don't know. We here today though. I, man, I love y'all. Sure. We, what, what we spent like 10, 12 minutes or something. Yeah, sure. <laughs> like we family now. Yeah. I did the oh, the last thing I wanted to ask was why do you listen to so much pop music? Yeah. Like what does that do for you? <laughs> like, people, yeah, yeah. Um, I don't know. I like pop music because it's different. Mm-hmm. On top of it being different, that's what a bag. Is. You know what I mean? So facts. You, you got, I, I got to, to, if I want to step in that lane, that's what I need to be studying. Like rap, cool. I got that down, down pat. You trying to get on them Diplo tracks Man, and shit? Well, I'm just trying, I'm just trying to get on our iHeartRadio Music Awards. Yeah, <laughs> just, so, yeah. so I'm trying. I'm, listen, I, I want to be different. I don't, when they when they say Tusi, they should think of different. Like, that should be the first thought that should come to people's head. Whenever they mention Tusi, they should think different. They okay. should be like, oh, right, that young nigga different. So 2020, what's Tusi going to accomplish this year? Everything, you dig? Mm-hmm. Hopefully, double XL. Um, Freshman, okay. Yeah, when double XL? When they, when they announce? That's like June, June, end of June. Yeah. Hope, hopefully, double XL. Um, and so much more. Ain't no whatever come come. God got me though. I'm good money. God got me. So whatever come come. But double XL, that's a, that's what we what I'm aiming for. Other than that, let it come. Let's do it. It's lit. All right. So, the two C two times. Don't forget the two times. Yeah, don't forget the two times. He's in Houston work. tonight. Got these fast ass girls everywhere looking for I'm him. Chilling. <laughs> I'm chilling. But until next time, see y'all need 93.7 the beat.